Let's talk about profit division issues in partnerships. This is one of the issues that commonly comes up, particularly in partnerships that are not carefully negotiated and formed in the beginning, because one of the core issues usually is who gets the money. At the end of the day, hopefully your business is successful, hopefully it's generating a profit, but then you need to think about how do you divide the money. Uh, in the old days, maybe you just had a 50-50 partnership, but what we see a lot of times now, particularly in our modern complex economy and world, is perhaps one person's working full-time for a business, maybe another person has another job, and they're just passively investing. They have money tied up in the business, maybe they have a reputation, maybe they have contacts, and they've made introductions to the business. So they're making differential inputs, which means maybe a 50-50 profit split isn't fair. Or maybe one of the partners should be drawing a salary or other form of income to compensate them for working full-time in the business while the other person is working passively. But you can see pretty quickly there's a lot of different ways to slice and dice the partnership money, the partnership income, the way to calculate the profits. In an extreme scenario, you might have a business that is indeed profitable before somebody draws a salary. But maybe that salary, what the fair market value of what one of the partners could make if they were working outside of the business, maybe that's equal to or greater than the partnership profits. Then what happens? Do you pay that partner their full market rate of salary and the divide the loss 50-50? You can see this is why you need to sit down and talk and, and what if strategy all of this before you start your partnership. So the first building block is to really have those conversations among the business partners. What are we doing? What are we each contributing? What do we each expect from the partnership? But then also, how do we build things up? And let's do some spreadsheets. Let's do some modeling. What if the business is running at a loss? What if the business is moderately profitable? What if the business is somewhat profitable? What if the business is extremely profitable? How do the partnership allocations work? In the ideal situation, you're going to be doing those types of calculations and allocations and planning and build that into those partnership documents. And again, we use the word partnership here on this channel for this video or the whole library of other videos we have. We're generally referring to multiple people working together in a business, not necessarily in the legal form of a partnership, maybe an LLC, maybe a corporation. All of these can have governing documents which have input on how the profits, how the income, how the money's divided. But the important thing to take away is you need to have these conversations. You need to have them early. So wishing you the best with your business planning. Go sit down with an experienced lawyer that's licensed in your jurisdiction, that's been through business law, that understands things. Discuss your options. Discuss what's going on. And, of course, I always recommend you subscribe to this YouTube channel because we have a whole library of videos on business and business law, and we have more coming for you and your future enjoyment. Also, if you'd like to, please join me in the comments. I'd love to hear what you're thinking, what questions you have, what you want to see in the future. And just remember when you do comment that the comments are not confidential. So don't put anything in there you don't want the rest of the public seeing. But I do look forward to reading your comments, and maybe you'll inspire a future video. Look forward to seeing your comments, and look forward to seeing you watching some other videos right here on the channel.